A new group of Hoosiers signing their letters of intent, the class of 2023, a group of four covering nearly every position on the floor. Coach Moore for this new group. What are your early impressions on this group of four that you signed for the incoming class? Really excited. Uh, as you mentioned, they, they cover all four spots. Excited that we got two of the top kids out of Indiana. You know, that's one of our goals here uh, is always to cover our state. And uh, with Shay and, and Jory uh, being two of the, the best, the best, uh, in the state of Indiana, uh, real excited. We've added some, some size as well uh, on the inside uh, with Ariel and, and Mackenzie Holmes. So uh, it's a class we're very proud of uh, and a class we're looking forward to getting on campus next, next year. Each group you kind of compare maybe the senior group that will be leaving or replacing them with the freshman class. How much does that play into maybe what you were looking for when you, you and your staff went out to recruit this group? Well, we wanted a dynamic point guard. Uh, you know, obviously, the, we, we feel like we have two right now currently, uh, but Shay just gives us a, a dynamic uh, you know, kid that uh, can, can facilitate. Um, she's, she's a terrific athlete. Uh, you know, we feel like Jory obviously fits a, she's kind of positionless, which is great. You know, the, the thing that we do know about Jory is that uh, in order to give your, yourselves a chance to win, you got to have her on the floor. Um, but uh, we really needed help in the low block area with Kim Royster uh, getting ready to graduate. Uh, Lindsay Marchese will be our only true returning big uh, that we have. Um, and so Mackenzie and, and Ariel obviously you know, fill, will fill that role of coming in and being able to play with their back to the basket. And we just felt like defensively we needed uh, bigger kids to take up more space on the low block as, as we move forward with, the, with our big team. Coach, each year when we go through the different signing class, we talk about some of the programs that these kids come from. And I know a critical piece when recruiting players is you want players that have had success in the past and, and know how to win. And right. it seems like this group is no different. Well, you know, Shade just won last year. Uh, Warren Central won their very first uh, state championship. Um, and they, in order to get there, they had to beat Jory Allen. Um, in a semi-state from Bedford, North Orange. So um, you hit it on the head. You know, we're always, uh, that's, that's part of the recruiting process is you're not just looking for the skill, uh, you know, the skill set. You're also uh, looking for those, those uh, young ladies that have come from winning programs. And uh, all four of these ladies uh, have, have won and have won at the highest level in high school. So, um, you know, that's, that's part of it. There are certain classes that you bring in maybe that have more size, strength, athleticism. What words come to mind when you think about the group that you put well, together? Well, size, size for sure. You know, Ariel's 6'5", um, Mackenzie's 6'3", and then you have Jory Allen listed at 6'1". Um, and so size is, is probably the best way to describe uh, this class, um, in addition to the fact that, uh, like I said, we, we feel like, um, as far as covering the state of Indiana and uh, being able to get the top kids uh, that want to come to Indiana, uh, we were able to accomplish that as well. Mackenzie is the first recruit for IU women's basketball from the state of Maine. Now that you're going into year five, how different is recruiting? You mentioned getting the two from the state of Indiana and then you go elsewhere for two more. How has that changed as far as going to different areas of the country? Well, we've always, you know, one of the things about Indiana is, is that uh, you know, a lot of people know the name Indiana. Our job is to go out and uh, promote women's basketball, certainly in a lot of these states. But uh, again, we always go back. We don't really mind where they're from. It's just if they fit a need that we, we have to have. And uh, you know, both Mackenzie and Ariel being our first uh, young lady out of Colorado, they just fit, they they both um, you know met needs that we had to have. And uh, now we'll continue to do that because we do feel like uh, we have a lot to offer here. Uh, not only a women's basketball program that has a tremendous foundation that has, has proven that we, we, we can win, um, but also a university that lends itself to so many different um, areas where they can uh, study and then just a reputation that Indiana University has. Um, so we feel like we can, we can touch any, any state here um, and um, if they fit our needs, uh, you know, there's, there's no question that we're going to recruit. We're going to recruit at a high level. Um, but we always want to come back to covering our state, you know, the state of Indiana, and wanting the best kids out of Indiana to want to come to Indiana.